Hi, my name is Ilma and welcome to my channel. I've been posting Christian blogs for 10 years now. Today I'd like to share Psalm 21 verses 1 to 13. Here's God's word. O Lord, in your strength a king rejoices, and in your salvation how greatly he exalts. You have given him his heart's desire, and have not withheld the request of his lips. Selah. For you meet him with rich blessings, you set a crown of fine gold upon his head. He asked life of you, you gave it to him, length of days forever and ever. His glory is great through your salvation, splendor and majesty you bestow on him, for you make him most blessed forever. You make him glad with the joy of your presence, for the king trusts in the Lord. And through the steadfast love of the Most High, he shall not be moved. Your hand will find out all your enemies. Your right hand will find out those who hate you. You will make them as a blazing oven when you appear. The Lord will swallow them up in his wrath, and fire will consume them. You will destroy their descendants from the earth, and their offspring from among the children of men. Though they plan evil against you, though they devise mischief, they will not succeed. For you will put them up to fight. You will aim at their faces with your bows. Be exalted, O Lord, in your strength. We will sing and praise your power. Psalm 21, 1 to 13. Here's a poem I wrote inspired by this psalm. The wicked will not succeed. The Lord is faithful to his anointed king and people. He brings them deliverance and protection against evil. The Lord will pour blessings to all those whom he has chosen. He annihilates the lawless and those who plot wicked tactics. Though the ungodly plans evil against the upright, he will not succeed for God is their shield and fortress. They may seem to progress with their schemes but God ensures that they do not eventually win. Praise and glorify a God who is steadfast in his love. He alone can bring you triumph, peace, and joy. Reflection. Why is it important to stay calm even in the midst of danger from evil attacks? If you are a child of God, you have the assurance that he has given his own son to uh, cover all our sins and pay for it. So we are um, exempt from the wrath of God. So in other words, even though we seem to uh, be amidst the ungodly, God eventually protects those whom he has chosen. So if you have faith, in the Lord Jesus Christ and if you have faith in our Heavenly Father why would any form of physical danger be a threat we know that our God is Almighty we know that our God is our vindicator he is our shield our protection our stronghold so if you live in that knowledge there is no reason for you to be scared. You can still be calm in the midst of danger and in all kinds of evil attacks because you know exactly that it is your God who is going to fight for you, who is going to be your shield, your protection, and your deliverer. So I encourage you to stay calm even though you think there is a hopeless uh, Thing that's going on in the situation because that probably comes from the evil one to make you feel hopeless and helpless. Thanks for watching. I hope you check my website at ilmaars.com for artworks, photographs, and a copy of this blog. And please subscribe to my channel on YouTube so I could make more videos to glorify our majestic God.